powder. And then I will be using the foundation today. I already own this, but I have a shade that's really light. So I had to pick up another shade, which this shade is 210 and I had 170. That was really light for me. And then I also picked up this ColourPop by Sarai through my eyes palette. And I can't wait to use that because I've had it for so long just sitting there and I haven't had a chance to try it out. And then I also picked up her um, Trio Lip Bundle, I believe. And it has a lip gloss, a matte liquid lipstick, and another liquid lipstick. So, but yeah, let's get started. I'm gonna um, prep my skin. For my primer, I will be using the NYX Oil Primer. And this really, like if you have really dry skin, I love this stuff. And lately my skin has just been really dry. So I have to really hydrate it. Especially for this foundation, it's a really matte foundation. Like it's not like a drying foundation, but it's not one of my favorite foundations to use for that reason because it's just like matte we're gonna go ahead and use the Benti foundation and I hope this matches me and I hope it's not too dark So, um, I think this color matches me pretty good. I think I did a good job on that, but we'll see. So next I'm going to go in with the concealer and as you all know, everyone's talking about this. So this is the Venti concealer and then I got mine in the shade 140. I think it's a little light, but it might just work. I don't know, the shade range is kind of hard and it's just really tricky to, I don't know, it was just really hard to pick a color, but I hope this is good. So far I think it looks good, but I think I'm going to add just a little bit more in here. So I also picked up the powder and I got mine in the shade butter I thought I got banana but I guess I didn't so we'll see if this one works out it might do good I don't know I'm kind of scared And then I am going to let that bake for a little bit. Let's see how that goes. And 
In the meantime, I will be taking my KKW Contour Palette. I love this palette. It's been my go-to lately, and I just really love the shades. I've been using these two. Um, I haven't really been into these two. Honestly, I haven't even tried them because, um, I don't know, I just really haven't been into those. But I will be taking this shade to bronze up and then contour with this one. and I'm gonna bake underneath as well we're just gonna leave that on for a few as well and then Okay, in the meantime, I'm going to just remove this powder. So far, it looks really good. Um, right here on this side, I have really dry under area. So on this side, ha I have really um, dry underneath here. And so I've been having a lot of issues with my concealer lately because of that same reason. But it's just like I've had really dry skin. So that might not help. But so far, the powder looks good. Right, and then I'm going to go in with blush. And this is... The Maybelline Fit Me blush in the shade Berry. And it's new to my collection. It's not new like in the beauty industry or whatever. But lately I've just been really enjoying this blush. And then I'm just going to go in here as well. Okay, and now I'm just going to remove the powder. And then... Then I'm going to go in with highlighter. This is the Fenty... Um, highlighter in Hustle Baby and it is a mini size And then, since I'm so extra, you know, I have to go in with this um, Wet n Wild Highlighting Loose Powder. It's a loose highlighting powder. So, like I said, I'm really extra. And for this reason, I will be spraying my brush. And this is such a beautiful highlighting powder. And there we go. Just gives you that wet look. You see that? Oh my god. You see that? Yeah, girl. Alrighty. And for that reason, I like it. 
And then, so I don't have a new eye primer, so I'm just gonna go in with this Benefit. It's an oldie, but a goodie. So I'm just gonna prime my eyes. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with the I Love Sarai um, through my eyes palette by ColourPop. And um, I don't know what colors to use, but her palette is just so beautiful. You guys can see that. Okay, so taking the shade Sandalwood, I'm gonna be placing that in the crease. And I really like that it has a mirror. That's really helpful. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay, so now I'm going to take this shade right here from the palette. And we're just going to work our way to the crease. And so taking my brush and just blending that out. These eyeshadows blend out so nice. Like they are really pretty. I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. And we're just gonna keep working our way up there. And then I'm going to blend that out. Okay, 
now I'm gonna spritz my brush and I'm gonna go in with this shade right there. It's a beautiful color. And then I'm just gonna place that that's what the eyes look like I think for now we're gonna just leave it like that and I might just keep adding more color but so far it looks really good okay so far I like it not too bad and okay so now I'm gonna just take my mascara and this is by Tarte it's one of my favorites. <clears throat> so going back to the palette, I'm going to take the shade Sandalwood again. And I will be using that for the lower lash. I don't think it's gonna show up as much, but. We'll see. And then, I'm gonna take this shade right here. Okay, now I'm going to take this purple shade right here for the lower lash line. So I think that it will work for now. Now I'm gonna take my eyeliner and this is by L'Oreal. And then I'm going to take my mascara again and just add some mascara to my lower lashes. Okay. 
So I'm gonna go in with this NYX lip liner in the shade, what shade is this? Sugar Glass. And it's just a nude. And then we are taking this shade right here from the trio and this is Sueño de Coco. I believe that's how you say it, yeah. Sueño de Coco. Okay, that looks a lot better. And my lips are a little bit dry though. All right, so I'm back. I went ahead and added some lashes. These are the Coco lashes in Baby G, and I like them so far. And then before I get done, I'm gonna be um, setting my face with this Mac Fix Gold Lit. I think that's how you say it. But I just love this. Whew. Girl. And this is the completed look. And so far, I'm really liking everything that I've tried today. And don't mind my hair, it's kind of fuzzy, but whatever. It's well, that completes this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below and that way you guys do not miss any of my videos and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Bye!